been an absolutely fantastic day and great for the community. You look at all of the people around here and everyone's got a smile on their face trying to find out how they can do their bit. You know, every year we celebrate the Eco Living Fair as a way of getting people together for the one day. But what we really want them to do is be active for 365 days of the year on the environment. You don't have to do too much, but as long as you're doing something to reduce your waste, conserve energy, you know, think about climate change, think about what the kids are going to live like in 5, 10, 15 years, and let's start working towards that. And that's what this event's all about, showing them how and helping them do it. This builds community. It lets people come together, learn a bit about stuff, see what's happening. And there's such an amazing array of things to do, apart from fantastic food and great talks. There's Marina Debris' brilliant Wasted Opportunity Shop, which is like an op shop of stuff that she has found on the streets of Randwick, just walking around, including TVs that work. So you can go there, you can you know, turn waste into, into things that you can have that would otherwise end up in landfill. There's all sorts of things you can experience and see that you know, you're just learning a bit about each time. But for me, the important thing about a festival like this is community. It's just about feeling part of something and having a beautiful day with your family or friends. One of my best tips for someone running a household is basically you try not to have any waste at the end of your week. If you have got anything left, you turn it into an omelette if you're a, not a vegan, but you try and use everything before you go out shopping again. We are selling all reusable products, so giving people choices and options. So our mission is to help people to make changes and become uh, zero waste and more eco-friendly in their households and their homes. What I'm trying to do to help the environment is to ban plastic straws. I'm really excited about it and I'm trying to get my friends involved. And just consume a little bit less, don't go and buy everything 24-7. I think it's got better and better. I think actually there's also been a, uh, an increase in the people that are coming along, which is really great to see the support. The general vibe is pretty good, you know, seeing everyone fighting for the environment and actually the kids' area is also pretty good, yeah. Oh, I've been presenting for Randwick for a long time. You've got this core of great people who really know how to make a regenerative culture here at this council. Events like this are really important because they're a mixture of awareness raising, you know, in other words, what is possible, plus how to do it. It's absolutely gorgeous.